Thank you. It really is a partnership. We raise the dollars, and Larry and Dr. Clifford Huddis help us decide where they go. It is, it is the wisdom of our scientific director, Larry Norton, and Dr. Clifford Huddis, who chairs our scientific advisory committee, and their peers, who take the dollars that we work so hard to raise and husband so dearly, and decide where around the world we have the best opportunity to get a yield for our investment. Um, they really look for transformative projects that are on the cutting edge where philanthropic dollars can move the needle forward. So I am indebted to Dr. Norton who helped Evelyn Lauder found the Breast Cancer Research Foundation and has stayed the course for his wisdom, his leadership, uh, and the esteem that he has held in the scientific community assures that we always hit our mark. There are so many people and organizations that should be thanked today, and let me just highlight a few. First of all, let me ask all of today's co-chairs to stand and be recognized. Andrea Brooks, Katherine Chapman, Kelly Doyle, Deb Hoffman, and Linda Nigeson. These girls said, women, people want information, knowledge is power, and we want to put together an opportunity for our friends in here in Boston to hear from the experts. Your attendance today is proof positive that people want the information, they want the new knowledge, and I am so grateful to them. To the Boston Harbor Hotel, this is our second home for the BCRF. Some of you know, but not all of you know, that um, Lucretia and Catherine and I were stranded here in the middle of the winter. Now, if you're going to be stranded somewhere, how would you like to be Eloise in the Boston Harbor Hotel, eating chocolate strawberries and doted on? It was heaven, though I called the office every day and said, oh, the snow, it's awful. <laughs> and then we said, yes and they took the best care of us. So to the Kelleher family, thank you so much. Chef Daniel Bruce, this lunch is wonderful. John Krellen, who has newly come at the helm of the hotel. I don't know if you've all met him, but John, you might want to stand since you're newly back in Boston. <laughs> Kelly Doyle, you are the welcome wagon, always rolling out the pink carpet. Nicole Semerall, Gary Sloper, the flowers in my room always take my breath away. Thank you all so much at this hotel. To the Reuben family and Reuben Wines, you contributed this beautiful drink. Please all enjoy. We thank them so much. Twist Event Design and Management, the tablecloths are glorious, and Winston Flowers, they did it again. They donated these beautiful centerpieces so that they and all who donated can assure that the money that we raise today goes for research. Kelly Tuthill is our spokesperson here in Boston. She is an eloquent and tireless advocate for BCRF, and her presence always warms my heart. And lastly, let me recognize the BCRF team here these events don't happen without skill and talent, and they are the most wonderful colleagues. <laughs> Thanks to the luncheon leadership and generous friends, most of what we raise today goes directly in the hands of researchers. I always say when I'm here, the money we raise in Boston stays in Boston, and I'm thrilled to tell you that this October, we have added three new local grantees to our roster. So that's what has been accomplished thanks to all of you. And so much of that capacity for funding here in Boston, which as Larry told you is $4.3 million this year and more than $36 million of BCRF support over the years, was derived from the hot pink party in the spring when we had the pleasure of honoring Rick and Nancy Kelleher. And they are tribute, um, it is tribute to them and how much they are loved in this community that we raised so much money that we could add three grantees. So thank you Rick and Nancy and their daughters for supporting us here in Boston. Over dessert, you'll hear 
hear from our esteemed panel. It is they for which BCRF exists. Um, we will have opportunity for questions and lively discussion. I think you will find it time well spent. You will go away better informed. Knowledge is power. So thank you for being here, and let me bring back the wonderful Kelly Tuthill.